One more time for the UAA ROTC and Mike Just. And may I please give a special thank you to all those who have served and to those who are currently serving in our United States Armed Forces. Thank you so much. much for being here. Now, if I could please have a big whoop whoop or a yell if this is your first time at a game of roller derby. Welcome, welcome to the world of roller derby. So just in case, I'm going to give you a quick real big crash course on what's happening. So we have two teams, obviously. On each team, you will see one skater that has a star on their helmet. That skater is the jammer. Now, the other four skaters on each team are the blockers. It is the jammer's job to get through and past the opposing team's blockers and then do that as many times as possible in two minute intervals that we call jams. Now, if they get through first, the first jammer that gets through upright and legally will be named the lead jammer. You can tell who is lead because one of our officials in stripes will be pointing at them. The lead jammer has the potential at any point in time to touch their hands to their hips twice, which will immediately end the jam. Now, once they get through first, that is their initial pass, and then afterwards, every time they pass an opposing blocker, they get one point. So there's a potential of four points every time they go by. And then, of course, whoever has the most points at the end wins. Welcome to Roller Derby. Currently, we do have lead jammer as number 324, Cherry Little Monster, skating for the Sockeye Sally. Completed the scoring pass, now approaching on an additional scoring pass. Jumps along that outside line, it's bringing four points to the 
Buckeye Valley. Tumble right there on turn two. Crystal wants for backup on their skates. Fort Knox box on the outside line. Crystal Monster goes by four points. Fort Knox box still locked in the back of the pack. They need to push through this defense to complete their initial pass before they can threaten points. Trace Little Monster testing the inside will go to the ground. Here's Little Muffer swings around the outside, up on those toes, off, clean pass, four points. Sockeye's 
No pack is called. See, the pack has to stay relatively close together. All of the blockers have to stay roughly within 10 feet of one another. If you get more than 10 feet from another blocker, you are out of play. If the entire pack is messed up, then there is no pack, and your immediate job is to just reassemble. Cherry's Little Monster now on a scoring pass, pushes by on the inside of turn two. Four points to the Sockeye Sally. Checks the outside line, Cherry's Little Monster cuts to the inside right as the whistle blows. That was a full two minute jam, four more to the Sally. Four by four, burn rage now on the line for the Sallies. We have a timeout being called by Fairbanks. They will have 60 seconds to discuss strategy while they go into the rest of the game. One big thank you to the Alaska Club, Alaska's best gym and fitness club for their support of Roller Derby as well as Rage City and the Sockeye Sallies. Very mixed up pack in the front. Maryland 
Adam on Wallace for me. Turns Little Monster calls off the jam after grabbing four. One big thing in his shirt's up where ideas become reality. Sherlock is loaded, already back on the track, ready for more. Gonna be going up against number 454, Burn Rage. review 
There's a lot of things that happen in roller derby, and while we put a lot of faith in our officials, when there's a tumble and stuff like that, it can be hard to keep track of everything that's going on. So each team gets an official review of our team thinks we saw something that the officials missed. And so we get to go into this little circle, have a powwow, present what the team believes they saw. The referees will go have a conversation about whether that is the case or not. And then we'll get a decision from the referees, which may or may not agree with the team, which may or may not result in a change of game. So the call that was in question by the Sockeye Sallies, they believe that they saw a incorrect star pass over on the Fairbank side of things. The official had a conversation. For the officials, they saw a upright and legal star pass. So no call, no penalty is made, and the Sockeye Sallies will lose their official review. Hurt Ridge checks that inside line. Low down, Hurt very carefully pushing on the outside. Burn Ridge up in the front of the pack behind that bastion of white trying to force an opening. Gets pushed out on the outside and resets. Track cut penalty on Burn Ridge. Means we got a power jab from Fairbanks. And they have lead jammer which gives them full control of this jam. Low down Derby Shane now on a scoring pass. Up at the front of the back trying to push by. Squeezes around Hellebutt. Four points to Fairbanks. There's a lot of advantage to be gained in power jams. Your blockers no longer have to worry about defense. Instead, they can mess up the opposing defense to help you get through. Hypno Thigh presenting a very strong wall for Derby Shane to try and fight through, forcing them to call it off, only allowing them two points as Burn Rage approaches the pack. Sherlock's and Logan, number 221 on the line for Fairbanks, up against number 47, Nikita. Sherlock picks up the speed, throws the shoulder into Shirk the Money Ice Feet before they can step back to try again. Squeezes around the outside! Lee Jammer is awarded to the Sockeye Sallies before Sherlock can get free. Nikita now with a short pass up at the front of the back, tries to get by just a couple of hits and falls it off. One point to the Sallies. Commercial printing at your service. Thank you for your support of Roller Derby. Maryland Monroe jamming for Fairbanks up against Cherry's Little Monster for the Sockeye Sally. Cherry's Little Monster just getting by on the outside line. Lee Jammer goes to the Sally. Marilyn Monroe trying to push by on the outside. Door quickly closes. Squeezed by Supernova up into the three top of the Sally. In the meantime, Trey Monster goes by for four points. Forearm penalty going to... Marilyn Monroe. Unfortunately, that forearm was earned in the middle of a star pass. Low down Derby Shane tossing the star cover to the side. That makes it a power jam for the Sockeye Sallies. Oh, I spoke way too soon. 
Green Little Monster makes their way to the penalty box, which will set Marilyn Monroe free. We don't ever want to have two jammers in the box because otherwise we'd just be sitting here just waiting for one of them to exit. So if there's a jammer in the box and the other one goes to the box, it immediately sets the first jammer free. That said, the second jammer only has to serve as much time as the first jammer has been in there. If they've only been sitting for 10 seconds, the second jammer only has to sit for 10 seconds. Out of play is called, Lowdown Derby Shame is free. Now we have lost our lead jammer, so no one can call it off. We will go for the full two minutes. Lowdown Derby Shame is trying to stay inbound on that inside line. Turns little monsters squeezing their hip through right in the middle of the pack. Four points to the right side. Turns Little Monster lost the speed already back around on his boring path. Whirlwind transitions on the outside as the whistles blow. Four more to the Sally with two to the Fairbanks. Two, two, one. Sherlock and loaded. Jamming four Fairbanks. 4x4, four four, current range, jamming for the Sockeye Salads. Current range leaning into that outside line, lateral inside, Sherlock in the back behind that wall of red, just trying to lean on them and hope that they'll get through. Blast through their own team, lead jammer Fairbanks! Sherlock gracefully skating their way around the track now on the scoring pass. Small swing to the shoulder, swings around, sprints up the inside and calls it off. Four points to Fairbanks. Thank you to Jack Duplos, DDS specialist in orthodontics. You're more than a patient, your family. Number 57, awesome sauce, now on the line, up against Nikita. No packing call, the pack must reassemble, which sets Nikita free. Lee Jammer goes to the Sockeye Saddle. Follows one of their friends around the outside. Jersey whips off with them. Four points to the Sockeye Sallies. <laughs> and he got another scoring pass. Goes on the outside line. Takes a quick tumble back up on their skates. More skates tumbling. Up at the front of the pack, two Fairbanks blockers remain with the pack. The Blockers assemble around them to get into bridge so that a no tax situation does not take place. Sweater kitchens and backfire doing everything they can to slow the hit down, but she's gone. Four points for the Sockeye Valley. They beat up on another scoring run. Has to fight through the full four wall of Fairbanks. Whirlwinds around the outside. Propels himself off a backfire. Four points. Low down Derby Shame in the back of the back. Trying to break through that red wall. Bit of confusion due to a penalty allowed for a bit more success as the Pita blows by the four more. Another scoring pass pushes by the Fairbanks wall at the back of the pack. Fast clean pass, four points. Powerful 20 point jam by Nikita. Remember, everybody, if you get your split the pot tickets, we will be drawn split the pot at the end of halftime.
Marilyn Monroe back on the line of four Fairbanks. Who makes an off against Cherry's Little Monster? Cherry's Little Monster with a quick shoulder check up against Luna Shumquist. More jumping to the outside line. Will be knocked out of bounds by Sherlock to load it. Forced to reset all the way behind the back. Four-arm penalty being called on a Fairbanks blocker. Three blockers remain as Coach Cherry's Little Monster down. Alaska's only full-service roller derby here 
Catering and Service Shop. They are skater owned and operated. Sherlock's been loaded immediately back out on the track up against current rate. Current rate stepping around the outside. Squeeze their way around Awesome Sauce to run into more blockers. Current rate is free. Lee Jammer will go for the soccer town.
Okay, do that again. Take that right foot, tap in the heel twice. Heel, heel, toe, toe, right, left, right, pause. Okay, so after you do that, you do a quick pause, and then we'll be changing the walk. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna take it from the Dorothy's. We're gonna do two Dorothy's, then into the kicks. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Dorothy, Dorothy, heel, heel, toe, toe, right, left, right, pause. We good? All right, take it from the beginning. So great right, right, great right, left, pace step, Dorothy, and then this. And five, six, seven, eight, great right, right, heel step, great right, left, Right together, left together, right together, left together, door feet, door feet, heel, heel, toe, toe, right, left, right, pause. Getting better? Yeah? All right. Now we're going to speed it up. Are you scared? No? Oh, that's good. All right, let's speed it up. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Great butt right. Great butt left. Right together, left together, right together, left together. Dorothy, Dorothy, heel, hip, toe, toe. Right, left, right, pause. Look at that. All right, so all we have left is changing on the wall. So from here, so changing on the wall. The next wall we're gonna face is a wall off to our left. So the way we're gonna get there, you're gonna take that right foot, tap it out to the side. Take the right foot, swing it, cross it in front. Slap your boot or shoe, whatever you got. Now I wanna turn towards that wall, kick it out. Swing it behind and slap your boot one more time. Or knock it off, you can do that. Then you're going to step back down into the great five to the right. And you start the sequence from the beginning. Okay? You want, if you can dance the rest of the dance, keep going. Okay. All right. So again, right foot is up in the front. Okay? You just did your right leg, right pause. With the right foot, step back to the side, swing it apart, slap. Swing it out and turn. Swing behind, slap. Step down to a great line to the right. Good. Now you get the idea. All right. So again, right foot to the front. All right. We're just working on the changing of the wall. So right foot out to the side, cross in front, extend and turn, sweep behind. Great line to the right. Great line to the left. Right together, left together, right together, left together, Dorothy, Dorothy, heel, heel, toe, toe, right, left, right, pause, side, front, side, behind, stop. Look at that, he just did the wall number two. Alright, so starting off, this will be wall one. Wall two, three, and four. Starting off on wall one, let's take it from the very beginning, take it all the way through. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Great right, right. Heels go great by left. And right together, left together, right together, left together. Door deep, door deep. Heel, heel, toe, toe. Right, left, right. Pause, side, front, side, behind. Great five, right. Great five left, right together, left together, right together, right together, go deep for deep, heel, heel, toe, toe, right, left, right, five, side, front, side, behind, great five, right, great five left, right together, left together, right together, left together, door deep, door deep, heel, heel, toe, toe, right, left, right, pause, side, front, side, high. Great five right, great five left, right together, left together, right together, left together, door deep, door deep, heel, heel, toe, toe, right, left, right, pause, side, front, side, behind, stop. 
That's our four walls. So, can you speed it up? Alright. So we're just going to do just the first few walls. Alright, see how we do. So, we're going to take everything you just did and just going to speed it up. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, great, five, right, great, five, left, right again, left again, right again, left again, Dorothy, Dorothy, heel, heel, toe, toe, right, left, right, pause, side, front, side, high, great, five, right, great, five, left, right again, left again, right again, left again, Dorothy, Dorothy, heel, toe, right, left, right, pause, side, front, side, high, great, five, right, Great, five, left, right again, left again, right again, left again, stop. I got real ambitious, I'm sorry. But you're doing so good, weren't they? All right. How are we feeling about it? You want to do it one more time before we quit the music? Yes? Oh. Yes? All right.
together, left together, right together, left together, don't be, don't be, feel, feel, so just press left, right, side, left, side, high. Right together, left together, right together, left together, don't be, don't be. Straight five, right, straight five.
Another lock on in order. Another scoring pass. Throwing their shoulders, trying to cut along the inside. Calls it off before the game can get there. Zero points on that final pass. Shout out to all of our squadrons for supporting Roller Derby. And this time around, thank you to Alex France Design. Jam 2 in the second half. Awesome Sauce versus Cherry Little Monster. Awesome Sauce pushing hard on that outside line. Cherry Little Monster digs in those toe stops to stay in bounds. Cherry Little Monster breaks free in the front. Lead Jammer, Sockeye Sally. Failure to reform penalty goes to Fairbanks Walker. Successful star pass goes to Sherlock and Loaded. Cherry's little monster grabs four and says, that's enough, end it there. Number 36, Marilyn Monroe, now on the line for Fairbanks. Going to be going up against number 454, Current Rage. Micro pack, both teams only with two blockers. Marilyn Monroe cutting up to the front, screen, trying to swing around the outside. Bird Rage already got on the inside. Lee Jammer, Sockeye Sally. Pack still incredibly small. Marilyn Monroe trying to get by Shabamigans. Looks like Sugar Honey Nice Four points to Bird Rage. Walker slowly pouring out of the box, reassembling a full pack. Bird Rage on another scoring pass, trying to just weave through Fairbanks. There it is. Four points. Bird Rage on another scoring pass. Side line, Herman breaks away, cuts to the outside. Gets pushed back to the inside by number 63, Violent Iris. Supernova and Shamanigans go to open up the door, get Herman through for three after the jamming. Sweater Kittens jamming for their first time tonight. Welcome to the star cover. Going up against number 47, Nikita. Sweater Kings with a hard shoulder in jamming and more jumping to that inside line. Nikita stepping over Fort Knox box, trying to find their own opening. Sweater Kings picking up a track cut penalty. Go to the box as Nikita picks up the lead jam. That means it's a power jam for the Sockeye Sally. Nikita with a clean pass on the inside. Good for four. Nikita coming up now to another scoring pass. Check that outside line. Push the scores. But it is a track cut penalty. They will go to the penalty box, which makes it a power jam for Fairbanks. Sweater <laughs> Kittens now in full with the power jam situation up at the front. Three salads left in their way, two salads left in their way, three top three fours. As they move into turn three, Shaman gets trying to push them down. Sweater King is buffled on the inside, but will pick up another track cut penalty. Which makes it a power jam for the Sockeye Salad! Pass and the 
Josh Watson and close the door. Grayson and Gibbs, turn off and loaded. Those with their own tumble as they stand up and try to get free as the whistles blow. Four points to the Sockeye Sally. Big shout out to Tattoos by Shelly, Tattoos and Piercings. Official go, but I'm not sure what for. Jerry's Little Monster off the line with a power start for the Sockeye Sallies. Up against the front one on one against Sir Locked and Loaded. Fairbanks Walkers reassembling. Jerry's Little Monster is free. Lee Jammer will go to the Sockeye Sallies. Triple Monster grabbing four and dancing it off the track. Her and Rage versus Awesome Sauce. Pushes right down the middle of the lane. Awesome Sauce attempts to do the same will be knocked out by Hell Half Fury and Brandy Manning. Back up on this day's recess to try again for Knock Box. They're trying to help them through just a little bit. Burn Ray continuing to swing from the outside to the inside, hoping to trip up that Fairbanks wall. They're not offering them much quarter though. Pressure block on a Fairbanks blocker set firm rage free. Lee Jammer Sockeye Sally. Firm rage blocks mostly after successful star pass to load out Derby Shane. Coming up now on the scoring pass, check that inside line, pass their hip, and the jam. Four points for the Skaters and Ray. Big shout out to Dr. Two, the Movement Clinic. Thank you for your support of Roller Derby.
Marilyn Monroe on the line for Fairbanks. Going to be going up against 324, Cherry's Little Monster. Sweater Kings trying to slow down Cherry's Little Monster who droops around the outside. Crashes into Piper Powder before getting free. Lee Jammer will go to the Sockeye Salad. Star Pass for Fairbanks. Your new jammer is Sweater Kings. Terry Bullhoff for sending them out of bounds. Comes back onto the track. Skips along by on the inside and calls off the jam. Four points. Big shout out to those that helped to document and record an archive roller derby. One big massive thank you to Flat Track Photography. Let me ask you all a question. Are you enjoying the music tonight? Of course you are. Thank you to our DJ, DJ Lefty. Got a timeout being called by Fairbank, so another big thank you to another entity that helped record an archive roller derby that is free frame photography capturing life's moments. Thank you very much. Violent Irish knocking them out of bounds. And he 
not phase right back onto the track. Pushes their own position out of the way. Lee Jammer goes to the ballot. Now with a scoring pass, trying to fight through that basket of white. Awesome sauce served their penalty, but they still have to complete their initial pass. Nikita is three for four. Jamming for their first time tonight, number 69, Supernova. 